check out the best team compositions here popular best team comps that's what i'm into the national team like this right which boss will we fight what's a pma i don't know what's a pms what's a pma boys recently i've noticed that there has been a lot of new players coming in to genshin impact now i like to consider myself as a knowledgeable veteran to genshin impact i know the tips and tricks the do's and don'ts of the game but as a new player you can only rely on what other people tell you. And sometimes you might come across misleading information that a new player might not be aware of. So today we are going to find and follow a beginner's guide to Genshin Impact and follow that guide as closely as possible just to see how accurate the information on the internet is let's go we're here at google.com uh yeah d yeah ignore ignore the uh ignore genshin impact new player guide which one do we go with you guys have to have looked this up before right which one do you guys follow the first one you want this one beginner's guide and how to play starting an account i mean i think you guys already know that what to do as a beginner okay let's go with that activate teleport waypoints adventure rank complete archon and story quests farm materials level up characters you will use upgrading statues of the seven wish for characters and weapons wait that's a high priority low priority complete world quests cooking food explore the region and find chests unlock shrine of deaths okay to be honest i'd argue this should be way higher i feel like unlocking shrine of deaths should be like right underneath upgrading statue of the sevens we're gonna follow Follow this guide word for word. Okay, let's do the first one. Activate teleport waypoints. Is there any teleport waypoints I have not activated? I found one. I found one. This one. This one. Let's go. Where is it? Show me it. It's up there. All right, let's go. I'm ready. No, let me... Dude, I can't. I'm climbing. I'm climbing. This, this cliff is a bit... This cliff is a bit steep, isn't it? What is this? Help, 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 help. How do you get up there? Hello? Maybe I go a different way. Wait, this is way easier. I just went to the wrong waypoint. Ready? Boom. Oh my god. There it is. And we're good? Then we're good. Uh, ignore this one. Ignore this one. That's a domain. That doesn't count. That's not a waypoint. Done. Adventure rank. What do I do with my adventure rank? Adventure rank, farming, and rewards guide. How to level up fast. Daily commissions. Let's do our daily commissions first then. This one's easy, right? This one just stand over here. It's gonna make me go up there, isn't it? Where is it? Oh my god. Boom. One done. All right, let's go. Oh no. All right, good. Two. Third one. I wish I had Venti for this. All right, another one done. Last commission. Are we done? Hello? Is this guy hiding? Can't escape this. Got him. There it is. Finished. Let's turn in our commissions. Let's see how much experience we get. Wow. 500 adventure exp right, let's see how much we need looks like it'll take a couple more days to level up but with that being said commissions finished adventurer's handbook what's that what's that again oh this thing um let me see if i've uh skipped anything um hmm all right we're done wow that was fast increase sacred sakura's favor oh no wait oh my god i'm not chest farming i only need one more true i only only need one more sigil let's go where do you even find chests these days uh let me just go here and try to find a chest this economy account yes <gasps> oh i think i saw a challenge on my way here there it is right here challenge <gasps> chest two sigils i'm rich oh my god it's time do it 34 200 adventure experience let's see how much more we need but you do get a crown though oh my god we will uh we'll come back to that let's not get ahead of ourselves here what's the next one worshiping statue of the seven let me see if i have any left uh mm, huh all right looks like we can cross that one off the list treasure hunting i'm not gonna run around in all fours hunting for chests okay there's <laughs> no no i refuse i refuse a hundred percent dragon spine the tree looks like we already did it this one's 12 levels it's easy it's not like the sakura tree where it's 50 levels this is manageable okay looks like we're good with our adventure rank complete archon and story quests i mean looks like we're done with that let's move on to the next section combat system and party setup team composition check out the best team compositions here oh let's go i'm ready popular best team 
team comps. That's what I'm into. The national team. So we have Xiaoling as main DPS, Xinqiu as sub DPS, support with Chungus, Bennett as a support as well. I mean, do you guys want to see this in action? I guess we can do it. What do we fight? I need something to fight. Xiaoling, Xinqiu, Chungus, and Bennett. Like this, right? So how do you actually play this? I've never actually played this before. Which boss will we fight? Oh, can we modify the wheel? What's a PMA? I don't know what's a PMS. What's a PMA? Oh, perpetual mechanical array. I just call it the mechanical cube. They don't have a golden wolf lord. And um Raiden. And one more, right? The twins. Twin bishops. That's it, right? Let's see what we get. We got the PMA, the mechanical cube. Are they built? Um, I, th I think. Does the guide show me the builds? Team comp. Oh my god, it actually show me the shows me the, the builds. For Xiangling, two piece crimson witch, two piece noblesse. For Xingqiu, four piece emblem. Chungus, two blizzard strayer, two gladiators, and Bennett, four piece noblesse. You know what? Let's follow the build. I like four piece emblem on Xiangling better, but uh the guy does not agree with me. Alright, let's take it from our Hu Tao. <laughs> Wait, what? Combat. I mean, combat. All right. Do I just take my Hu Tao's thing? I mean, to be honest, that's two piece Crimson Wish. Now I need two piece Noblesse. I have a good Noblesse piece on this one. Noblesse. All right. Can go with this. This can be whatever, right? Let's go with a really good piece. This one. Let's see what our stats look like. Looks pretty good. These are some pretty decent stats. Does this say what weapon I have to use? Hello, weapons. Weapons. It doesn't even show me the weapons. Give me the weapons. Should I use Homa then? Should I use my level 80 Homa? Let's see. How good is this? It's pretty good. I do, in fact, have four piece emblem already. So we just need to update the weapon, which is a miss splitter. No recharge. We're not going for recharge here. We're just trying to maximize our damage. Jake Cutter is better? You think Jake Cutter is better? Okay, let's see. I mean, like, I think these stats are reasonable. You think I need 92% crit rate to crit? Use a 3 or 4 star weapon? Yeah, but I have a 5 star weapon. Crit damage circlet? Okay, I'll use a crit damage circlet. Do I, do I even have a crit damage circlet? Like this? This looks a bit better, right? What about Chungus? My Chungus is not very well leveled yet. You know what? I'm gonna send him as well. Let's get him up to 60. There it is. Weapons. What weapons do you use on him? Let's do the artifacts first. Two-piece Blizzard Strayer and two-piece Gladiators. Looks like it's a mess right now, but we will fix it. Ayaka, give me this. I'm pretty sure I need crowd damage bonus, right? Oh my god, 13% crit rate? That's pretty good. I'll put this on, actually. Okay, I'll put this on as well. All right, that's two-piece blizzard. And now I need two-piece gladiators. Do I have a good gladiator piece? I have one. Any good gladiator pieces? I do not have a single gladiator flower. Hello? Oh, Xiao has one. Oh, official. All right, let's swap with this one. Okay, two-piece gladiator, two-piece blizzard. Let's see our stats. I'm getting pretty good numbers. What weapon should I use, though? Wolf's Gravestone? Everyone's spamming Wolf's Gravestones. Though I guess I have to use it. Unless Red Horn? Huh? Crit damage? 80%? What does it even look like? That's that's actually really high. <laughs> we'll use Wolf's Gravestone. 52 crit rate, 155 crit damage, but 2,600 attack. That's a lot of attack. But my talents, though. My talents? I think I need to level up my talents. What do people usually level up? The Burst? I level up the Burst. All right, Bennett. Four piece no bless. I think he's all set. Weapons? Level 90 Aquila Vaphonia. I think we're all set. Are we good to test? Let's see how this goes. I mean, based on my experience, Bennett's burst always comes first. And then since Chungus and Shaolin's burst snaps to Bennett's burst, it's best to use either Chungus's burst or Shaolin's burst first. But I'm probably just going to go with Bennett's Chungus, use his burst, slam down his E. Shaolin, use her burst, put down Guaba, and then Xingqiu, put down his burst and switch back to Shaolin. Just spam. You know what? Sounds good. Plan? What's the plan? I'm auto-attacking. I'm auto-attacking. Am I doing a good job? Is this good damage? It's pretty good. But now I don't have a burst. Now what? Now what do I do? What do I do for the next, like, 20 seconds? Help. It's all up to you, Bennett. It's all up to you. <laughs> Can I kill this with Chungus' burst? Chungus, go. Oh, I killed it with Chungus' burst. But now what? Go, Xingqiu. Go. It's actually doing it. I got it. That wasn't that bad. We'll try, like, a couple more team comps. Ball national team. I mean, this is literally just swap Chungus out. Morgana. It's pretty expensive with three five-star characters, two of which are from limited time banners. Luckily, my account is bugged, so I have all of it. 
Let's set up our team. Ganyu. There's Venti. There's Mona. And then there's Diana. Is that good? What do I even test this on, by the way? You can't freeze bosses. What are you supposed to test this on? Abyss? I guess we can try Abyss. All right, let's see the artifacts. Four-piece Blizzard. Four-piece Veridescent. Four-piece Noblesse. Two-piece Tenacity. And two-piece Maiden Beloved. Is that really her best build? Let's see. Ganyu. All right, got that one. Venti, four-piece Veridescent. Also got his best in slot bow, so I think that's good. Mona, four-piece Noblesse. These stats looks good. Diano, do I even have a good Maiden's piece? You know what? Let's level one up. But this one sucks. Wait, do I have a better one? Can I get an HP percent roll on these things? I'll just use it as is. Level seven artifact piece. Do not do this at home. This is just for demonstration purposes. I'll level this one as well. It gives me HP. You know what? I'll just use it as is. How bad can it possibly be? Level four artifact. Let's go. Better than zero. Level three. I misspoke. Bam. There it is. What weapon do I use? Sacrificial bow is good enough, right? I think we're good to go. Why is it level one? Uh, we don't talk about that. Okay, we need a suckable floor for venti. Floor 10? Floor 10 looks good. Let's do floor 10. Venti's burst first. Swirl. Diano. Ganyu. And then just attack, right? Okay, now what? All right, group him up again. I swirl. I swirl. No, no, I swirl the wrong thing. No, no, that's pretty good. If you can suck the enemies. I'm not doing it right. Wait, well, how am I not doing it right? I didn't use Mona ult. Let me try again. I didn't use Mona ult. They die too fast. What am I supposed to do? I built them too good. Disable artifacts. What's the point of disabling artifacts if they're going to give me artifacts? Maybe I disable the weapons. Level one hunter's bow. Bam. Level one. Deanna. Level one. We scale down a bit. I think we're good now. Now the abilities won't kill them even before we actually show the freeze part. They're still kind of dying pretty fast though. Oh my God. It still does 6K with a level one weapon. Help. They die too fast. Wait, wait, wait. Swirl this thing. Swirl, swirl. How's this thing still alive? Mona's burst. Let's do Diano's burst. And let's do uh, Ganyu's burst. They're literally dead before I can even charge attack with my Ganyu. He's frozen and he's dead. What else do they have? Check out leveling guide here. Oh my God, I can level up fast. Farm Blossoms of Revelation. Blossom of Revelation. This one? What's going on over there? What is even happening? Is that a ritual? I can show up my Morgana team here. There. Boom. Check that out. Blossom of Revelation. Bam. Defeat all opponents. Okay, I got this. He's trying to kick me, but he's not really good at it. Come here. Hit that thing. Got him. Hit that thing. Yeah, hit that thing. That guy knows what's up. He's just throwing random stuff over there. He's not even coming close. What's he trying to throw, by the way? Those knives? What is that? Do it again. Ow! Got it. Condensed resin or original resin? What does condensed resin do? I'm a new player. I don't know what a condensed resin is. What is a condensed? Condensed resin is a consumable that can be created. Bam, nine. I got nine books. What else can I do to level up my character? Bought from shop? Oh, buy from shop, huh? There we go. You know what? I might as well just, I have a bit of currency. You know what? Looks like we're good. Characters and constellations, tips and tricks. You know what? Let's go for tips and tricks. Don't forget to use up your resin. It looks like we need to spend some resin. What's the next tip? Try to save your fragile resin for artifact farming. Already on it, boss. Already on it. Try to cook food whenever you can. No, that's cheating. That's cheating. Food is cheating. Who said to use it? Just cook? You're right. You're right. Okay, let's cook some food. Wait, but how do I cook? I'm completely new. How do I cook? How do I cook? How is that the first thing that shows up? Genshin Impact. To cook in Genshin Impact, you need access to either a campfire or a stove see a fire cook what to make what's my favorite food on here eggs 99 eggs i got 79 sparkling eggs and 20 eggs on a fancy plate and has a toothpick on it what else is there what else is there primo gem management you can use it to wish for new characters and weapons forging mystic enhancement orbs you could do that you could use it to forge ores that's not primo gems those are resin 
I get EXP for it. I think that's good. Honestly, I was expecting something way worse. I think the most important part is the team comp one, right? Most people probably look up team comps to see what characters they should pull for. I feel like the only one that's wrong is Shaolin's. Shaolin's set is, should be Emblem of Fate as well. Four-piece Emblem of Fate. Because realistically, these will give you the most damage, but in a realistic situation, you do no damage without your elemental bursts. That's old guide? Best team build 2.5. Last updated was yesterday. We are in 2.6 we're not in 2.6 I, I cannot believe what patch are we in genshin impact wait 2.0 we're in 2.0 genshin impact 2.6 release date march 30th you are a bunch of liars the guide is right you are wrong pretty legit guide if i do say so myself 